It is our privilege to make Christ known to others and our joy to share Him with others every day. Books are everywhere. You might have shelves full of novels, textbooks stacked high on your desk, or children's books scattered around the house. We're so used to books that it's hard to imagine that some people don't have access to them. Imagine this. Wanja, a little girl in Nairobi, Kenya, is trying to learn how to read. But in her house, there isn't a single book, and she has no access to a library. Even textbooks at school are shared among six other students during class. When Wanja is 10, she'll only be able to make out simple words, Peter, Jane, dog, jump. As she gets older, she'll fall further behind, and chances are she won't pass the simple tests required to get into high school. She may not even be able to read the questions. If Wanja doesn't get into high school, she'll likely never leave the square mile she was born in. She'll work most of her life as a laborer, and she may be forced to make desperate choices to survive. But all that can change with a book. That's why we're challenging people and organizations across the world to donate one million books that will become libraries across Kenya and Africa as a whole. Here's how it works. Every book in a buck you donate will be added to a shipping container in your region. Once a container is filled with 35,000 books, it ships to Kenya where it becomes a mobile library serving three schools. In a short time, and with your help, We'll have 1 million books and 100 brand new libraries on the ground in Kenya and beyond. So take a look at all those books you have around you. Imagine them in the hands of a student on the other side of the world, shaping a much better future for Wanja and thousands of children across Africa. Visit echoafrica.org and start making a difference today. Journey to Better Health presents the Living Well program starting every Monday, May 1st. Registration is $28. This workshop is for people living with one or more chronic conditions and their caregivers. And here are some youth events we'd like to highlight. We have the Mother and Daughter Tea on Saturday, May 20th at 2 p.m. The Keep the Flame Burning second annual youth retreat will take place July 27th through the 31st in Ohio for all middle and high schoolers. Family VBS will be Monday, June 29th through the 23rd at 7 p.m. Come explore ancient Rome with your entire family. And all 2017 graduates headed to college in the fall should apply for the 2017 Carol McDaniel Turner Scholarship. St. John is collecting 50,000 books in the month of May. The books are going to be donated to a chapel in Kenya. So pick up your shipping boxes on Sunday, April 30th and we'll give you more information on when to return those books back to the church. And our Power Hour anniversary service will be Wednesday, May 3rd, with the Reverend Joseph Fobbs preaching. Check the bulletin, the webpage, and our church app for all information that is St. John. Church, what are you doing to make Christ known to others? Respond by using hashtag SJBCTalks. <laughs> 